Uh, Elon Musk. Elon Musk free or slay. Now, Space Karen was trending on the Twitter. And that was referring to Mr. Elon Musk, our friend. I, I, I think there's people who are such fanboys of Elon they're going to turn off our podcast right now. Don't. Mm-hmm. We don't hate Elon. We're not Elon critics. We're, we're a bit realist here. I mean, come on. Uh, he was... Uh, <laughs> he said the pandemic would be over April 1st. Okay. This is what I don't get, Brian Stockton. Help me out here. The man is clearly a genius. And not just yeah. a business person genius, a engineering genius, a logistics genius. How does he not get what I do and you do, and we're clearly not geniuses. We have some things we're good at, maybe. Um, I won't say what mine are, but how does he get this wrong? How, how does he say that, uh, you know, he's had two, he's like criticizing the tests and he doesn't understand the antigen test. The real answer to the rapid antigen test where he got two positives and two negatives is a return a result yeah. in less than 30 minutes. This is to be used when you are sort of overwhelmed and it picks it up when you are riddled with the disease. It is uh, for an emergency situation. It is not the normal test that you get up the nose. Yeah, so he was uh, positive for COVID, but also negative. And then, yeah, he was complaining that why these tests don't work. But everybody knows the tests are not 100% accurate. So um, it's a weird thing to complain about. I don't know why he's so um, off on this issue, but I can relate it somewhat to Steve Jobs. You remember Steve Jobs, exactly. uh, of course, the uh, uh, potentially another genius, yes. uh, engineer, d- designer, and so forth. He his blind spot was his cancer. Like he died of pancreatic cancer, and from what I remember reading, he he really resisted treatment for a long time. It's like he thought he could cure it himself oh, by man. you know eating vegetables or something. So there's something about when you're right, ninety nine percent of the time, because you know these Steve Jobs and Musk, they're the smartest people in the room probably for most of the days of their lives. Um, it's when they're wrong about something, they just don't realize it. Uh, yeah. Okay. That that actually was helpful. Thank you. Thank you for that. that You're welcome. Uh, that, that did give some perspective on it. Uh, 